What's up everyone, this is Cybernet, and today I was able to find some more older packs, so let's open up three packs of Yu-Gi-Oh! Invasion of Chaos. So yeah, this is one of my favorite sets that has ever come out for Yu-Gi-Oh! I mean, it's one of the better sets, you know, that a lot of people remember, and yeah, there's a lot of terrifying cards in this. So I was able to find three of these at Walmart, I don't know if they're the only place that sells these, but basically you get an older pack of cards, which is actually, I believe, from Legendary Collection, I think that's basically all of them are from Legendary Collection, and uh, you get uh, two rares and eight commons. Unfortunately, I can never find the ones people are talking about where you actually get, like, two holographics or something, so... I don't know. Maybe if I, you know, go out of town at some point, I'll see if I can find something like that. But anyway, Invasion of Chaos. Let's go ahead and open these up and uh, see what we get from them. They have a bunch of different ones, though, like this. The only thing that's unfortunate is that the ones with the uh, commons and rares are actually pricier than the ones where you get hollows. How does that make sense, right? There we go. Let's see what we get for our rares and commons. First off, have uh, XC Change Tactics. That's kind of cool. UA Goalkeeper. Man, I miss UAs. And what else do we have here? Ghost Beef always kind of creeps me out. <laughs> and ritual and everything, too. It's a lot of uh, Maximum Crisis and, and those kind of commons. Let's see. Invasion of Chaos. Let's get, I don't know, uh, Dark Magician of Chaos. Sure. <laughs> He's on the front. Might as well ask for that. Hopefully we get something good. DD Borderline. Remember that card. Witch Doctor of Chaos. Chaos Sorcerer, that's pretty good. Zero Gravity, and uh, Fuma Shuriken for our rare. So we got a rare out of that one. Crimson Ninja right afterwards, that makes sense. Torpedo Fish, Terra King Salmon, and Ojama Delta Hurricane, which uh, I still love Ojamas. That card's pretty cool, too. All right, second pack. It's still kind of tough to get hollows out of these older packs, too. They're old enough, like I said. <laughs> They're not the original ones, but old enough on that. I Iron. Then we have uh, Winged Rhinos. We're turning alive. That's pretty good. Primal Cry. There we go. That's the uh, Ritual Spell for Ritual Monster we got. Anything else? Baboon. That's pretty good, I guess. Not terrible commons, but, uh, you know, <laughs> again, I'd still rather get some hollow cards or, or something, you know? I still hope I'm going to open up one of those get, like, Legend of Blue Eyes comments. That'd be cool. Let's see. Uh, Yellow Luster Shield. Gigantis. Then Dimension Distortion. Sea Serpent Warrior of Darkness, and we have a Destruction Ring. So, yeah, that's another rare for us. Instead of Ring of Destruction, you have Destruction Ring. Kind of cool. Curse of Forbidden Spell, Sacred Crane, Chaos Greed, and Crimson Ninja again. Kind of cool. And now we are down to our last pack, so hopefully I can end with a hollow. Let's see. Also, too, I hope you guys are enjoying the opening video, so be sure to uh, like this video and uh, subscribe. It helps out a ton. And I can't open up this pack. There we go. But yeah, subscribe for more Yu-Gi-Oh! openings and deck profiles, news, all kinds of things. Alright, what do we have for our rares and everything? So, we have Destruction Punch, which I always, I always felt bad for the dude that's getting hit. Dang. <laughs> Pretty brutal. Then we have Offering to the Immortals, and then, ooh, Dark Radicator Warlock. Oh, that's cool. That's actually from, uh, w which one is that? It's one that has OP02. That's actually from a promo pack. That's cool. And a pretty Archfiend. <laughs> That's good, too. Tiger Axe. Oh, man. Actually, some awesome uh, commons. Not bad. I wonder if you can get, like, something that's really hard to get. And last pack. Invasion of Chaos. Like I said, let's end with a hollow. I hope so. Multiplication of Ants. Not bad. A Hero Emerges. Begone Knave. And I got an ultra rare. <laughs> yes, we ended with a hollow. That is awesome. Manicore of Darkness. Oh man, I still remember the combo with this and what was it, Card of Sanctity, I think? We're basically, again, I'm not sure, I know that's always the game I bring up, but I played the game for years, I swear. And you could combo it together with a loop and keep drawing cards and get Slifer like to just insane amounts of attack. And I remember using that combo so many times back then. So this is uh, actually a pretty nostalgic card for me. So that is awesome, especially in Ultra Rare. And also Enraged Battle Locks. Also, uh, Prickle Fairy, uh, Recycle, Fenrir, 
and then sal uh, salvage. Well, that's actually pretty good. I almost said salvation. Salvage <laughs> is the name. Uh, but yeah, that's actually a good common too. So there we go. That's the opening. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Uh, at least we went with the hollow, so I'm happy on that. And like I said, some of those promos or, you know, comments that were from promo packs, I should say, were actually pretty good. So uh, yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed. And of course, if you've gotten any of these packs, let me know if you've had some good luck getting, you know, comments from it or even the hollows. I know some of you have talked about how, again, how you're finding some of these with holographics. I'll, I'll be on the lookout, but where I live, there's three Walmarts and none of them have them like that. So maybe it just depends on what state you're in. No idea, but I'll, I'll still be on the lookout for them. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe for more Yu-Gi-Oh! videos. And of course I will catch you guys later. See ya.